if you're going to protest, it has to be, would you think, in a meaningful sort of a about way? About what, though? No. Well, about anything. There was yeah. a, did you see the boxer, the French boxer, who decided to protest, right? He got disqualified mm -hmm. uh, for intentionally headbutting his yep. opponent, right? So it was awarded to his opponent, the, yep. uh, the bout. And then he just sat on the um, ringside, yeah. right, for 15 minutes. Everyone was just sort of watching. And then he got off. Said enough's enough. No, no, no. Oh. Then he went. And apparently he went to the toilet mm. and then he came back Jesus. again and sat back down again. Long but you know the story. whole thing about the protest? What? There was nothing going on. Like there were no more bouts. To <laughs> I, I, forgot, I forgot what point you're trying to make <laughs> halfway through that story. Well, the point about it is if, is you're gonna, if you're going to be protesting, it has to be a meaningful protest. You want to have okay. – if you're going to protest – No, no, good get, point. Get no, people that's a good actually, point. No, shush. If you, <laughs> okay, that's it. Good point. That's the last time you're going to do that. <laughs> good point. Don't get offended, Watson. <laughs> I think, I think. For well, the, what are we going? What, what, what are we in a hurry to get to? I think for the very first time, I did in our in our professional <laughs> life, you got a bit snappy with me. Then, well, what are we in a hurry to get to? Just tell me that. <laughs> I don't, nothing. I well, just, why cut me off when I'm in the middle of making a magnificent point? <laughs> <laughs> you got you got snitchy with me, didn't you? I did. You did. You weren't listening First to what I was saying. Ever. I think we've just about got all the quotes in to fix uh, the panel here. Uh, oh, come it, on. it hasn't been I, fixed yet, has it? I did. I was. Is I did work experience as an electrician. I could have whipped out that thing and <laughs> cleaned it and put it back in. Have you spoken to the boss? No, about I the haven't. Cost of this. I oh, don't. Oh. Turn it up. Well, hey, accidents happen, mate, and they do. It's I would blame the people yeah. that design the damn thing. Yeah. You did know you did. did you offer to pay though at any stage? Why would I? No, I'm just asking. It wasn't my fault. I'm not saying you need to. I'm wasn't just my fault. I'm just asking you. Did you offer to pay for the coffee you spilled? If you design a desk <laughs> and it's got three centimeters for me to put a coffee, then you're asking for trouble. Have a listen to some of the names in the South Australian squad too. Uh, Bruce Abernathy. Graham Corns. Yep. Maxie James, remember him? South mm. Melbourne? Yeah, high flyer. Yep. yep. Uh, Greg Phillips. Peter Jonas. Yep. Johnny Roberts went to South Melbourne as well. Mark Williams, Choco. Uh, Russell Ebert. Phil Michael, Malin. Michael Taylor. Paul Weston. Yep. Great player for the Bombers. Ralphie Sewer. Uh, Ralphie Sewer, yes. Nickname? <laughs> um, <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I used to call him Werribee, they called him. Yeah. Can you remember Basil Campbell? I, he was in the West Australian squad. I don't remember Ralph Sewer. So this was <laughs> – let's get off that. Is he a good player? <laughs> it was shit ass. He passed off. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Bang! From the whispers. Why the kids oh, are getting, you wanted to set kids it up there. getting driven to school <laughs> when you, you kept, went with it. You kept going. <laughs> I'm just obliging you. That's all I'm doing. Boy. Have you seen it? Boy, I need. Recommended to by one of my boys. Right. It's a New Zealand movie about a, a young. No, I haven't seen it. No. Oh, it's a. If you've seen Boy, let me know what you thought. It was a feel good smile. I laughed. Really? I had a good chuckle. All the way through. So storyline. So um, the little New Zealand family, uh, broken family. The dad was, I think, he was in jail. It's a comedy. He was oh, in, okay. He was in jail. The grandma goes away, leaves boy, who must be about twelve or thirteen, to sort of look after three or four little kids, and then the dad comes back with his so-called gang. Like it's a pretty juvenile-ish sort of a comedy. Right. But it was funny. I liked it anyway. Uh, that's the movie update for you. <laughs> When you tell me about your boring as batshit movies, I sit there and go, <laughs> well, oh, yeah, well, that's right. What else? Well, I've just asked go, you a couple oh, of questions it's, about oh, it. Oh, yeah, it's got subtitles and this. And I go, oh, yeah, good. I try and try and glean something out of it to share. <laughs> you, you go. <laughs> I thought you had you something go, left. Oh, yeah. I thought you had something. Silence. I thought you had something left. <laughs> if that doesn't bore people witless, <laughs> nothing will. <laughs> If there's a, a, a dog behavioural specialist dog. out there, dog behaviour specialist out there somewhere, I've mm -hmm. just got, Brando's got this thing that he does, Gary, mm -hmm. where he'll go and take the toilet roll off the holder and then chew it up and take it back to bed. I'd just like to know if there's something that what, what I the can be paper? doing. Well, the, sorry? What happens to the actual paper? He chews it up and just 
Well, he takes the whole roll. He takes the whole roll. He just lifts it off the off the holder <laughs> and takes it back to his bed. Yeah, well, buy him In the a, middle of the night, I heard him doing it again. Buy him his own toilet paper then. People got some great advice for me. There's a lot of dog behaviour specialists out there. Yeah, close, close the toilet. <laughs> 100%. You can, pay, you can get a dog specialist paying 400 bucks to come and sort Brown out, or you can shut the dunny door. Australia's That's not what I was looking for. 23 <laughs> run loss. We told you that in the T20s against the bangers. We didn't see it because it's not been televised, but 100 and, they need 132. They're all out for 108. It's just not good enough, the Aussies. Someone else has got the same problem, the same issue here with the toilet roll. We now take it off at night. Well, shut the door. I might no. I might just take it off. I might take the toilet bowl to bed with me. <laughs> Jeez, what about put it uh, back on the holder when I get up in the morning? <laughs> what? What does it say? <laughs> tell, Thank you, everybody, for your advice. tell Brando about one of your movie reviews. That'll <laughs> bore him out of his bad behaviour. Yes, uh, somebody said that if I put deep heat on the toilet roll, mm. uh, that uh, Brando. He, won't he, go near that's it. That's right. And uh, Lady Susie won't be happy. <laughs> that wouldn't be a good result. <laughs>